In this video, we're going to simplify the fraction 3 over 8, 3 eighths. So we want to see if we can reduce this to a simpler form where we have whole numbers. So we want to see if we can put this in a different fractional form that's equivalent, the value is the same, but we have lower numbers for the numerator and the denominator. To do that, we need to find a common factor for both 3 and 8. Really, 3 and 8 don't have a common factor other than 1. 2 goes into 8, but it doesn't go into 3. 3, that goes into 3, but 3 doesn't go into 8. So this is already simplified. 3 eighths is already in its reduced simplified form. If we wanted to look at an equivalent fraction, we could multiply the top, the numerator and the denominator by 2. We could get 6 sixteenths. That would be equivalent to 3 eighths, and we could simplify this back to 3 eighths. But really, 3 eighths, we can't reduce this any further. This is Dr. B simplifying the fraction 3 over 8. Thanks for watching.